There's big jobs broken out here, but we're not doing it, are we? No, we are not. No, professionals are doing it. As you can see, no seats. They've gone. They're out for a reason, aren't they? Yes. Why are they out for a reason, Em? So, around about two years ago. A couple of weeks ago, really. <laughs> no, about two years ago. Ah, a couple of weeks. We went and bought some newer front seats. Out of, it was out of a 2021 crafter. No, it wasn't until 2019. Was it? Two years ago. And it was a completely different seat design. Yes. Somebody thought that they were going to fit. Yes, you did, didn't you? I did, yeah. Yeah. Mm, wrong. Totally wrong. However, we are lucky enough to know some people with a little bit of expertise oh. that we don't have. We call them magicians. <laughs> Honestly, God. <laughs> magicians. So, they have kindly said that they will help us out because it's a it's an important job. Mm. Safety and things like that, isn't it? Yeah. These two geniuses here are going to negotiate the design of this seat onto the new style seat. Again, like I said before, something that you really want to get a professional to do, like, you know, fabricators or people who know a bit more than me. So, let them crack on. And um, Liam has kindly gone and bought a service kit for his van. So we're going to change the oil filter, air filter, oil, what else? Uh, oh, uh, a cabin filter, pollen, Just pollen filter. I'll show you how it's done, mate. Don't worry. It's Go oh, right, cool. This will, <laughs> this will be interesting recording. So, right, we'll crack on with that. Intelligent people are cracking on with that. And Emma's going to make a tea. Fabricator extraordinaire here, as um, <laughs> all I can say is he's whipped Sean into shape, taught him a few things, and um, managed to actually get the seats in. So they're in now. We'll show you them in a minute, but we'll show you the reason why we wanted them in in the first place. Going to make a massive difference to us, and thanks to the uh, master fabricator extraordinaire. <laughs> And Sean, we, um, we'll be able to get it done because we wouldn't have been able to do it. Well, we might have been able to do it, but the first time I'd have put the brakes on, Ember's gone through the front window. Right, well, the seats are all in, aren't they? All done and dusted. Yes. What are the reasons we changed the seats from the original Crafter ones to the new 2019-2020 ones? Well... Comfort. Comfort, and it gives us an extra option. So there are the new seats that are in the, the crafter now, as well as being the bonus of the dogs can be there and we can still get under the seats into each individual seat. Because on the last set of seats, we had to lift both up at the same time. We didn't have the option to individually lift each seat. Yeah, so these, obviously it comes, you can lift both sides up separately, which is a massive bonus. One of the main reasons we decided that we wanted these is because if we were in transit and Emma needed to get them back for some reason, we couldn't because she'd have to climb over. But not anymore. So now all we have to do, pull a little tab and then that pops down and it's easier to get through. Even if we're in the front or if we're in the back and we need to get into the front for some reason it means putting this down we can get into the front or um, get into the back and it's just easier and if the puppers aren't with us we can have this down and we've got cup holders that's the kettle they do still swivel around like the other ones did it still locks into the same seat base so i have undone some of the screws so just like the other ones they will spin round.
and give us the living area. And then if we were to sit there, we could put this down. And you've got another table if you are sitting there. Just makes it better. And as well as changing these ones out and getting the guys at Mule to basically make them so they can fit to the bracket that's in our van because they're not meant for our van because they do have legs on them as they go direct to the floor. So the boys at Mule, they're a bit clever. So as well as having them, we've also got a basically a brand new seat because our old crafter seat was absolutely diabolically chewed away. And we got that off Sam from the Crafty Blinder. Technically it was Sam's brother, but Sam did bring them up to us when we were away. So thanks, thanks for that, Sam. Sam. So yeah, brand new seat and arrangement and they are much better than the old crafter seats. Plus they're just newer. Um, are they comfy? So comfy. The only thing I've got is I can't put my legs on the floor because it is a little bit higher than the old ones, but that's fine. So what we're gonna do is on the floor of the crafter there, we're just gonna make a small box, basically to fit into that area, the same shape, and we'll put a bottom on it and a top on it, and then it can be used as well as a little bit of extra storage. Um, you won't get much in there, but it will just mean that it's up that much that Emma's feet will touch the floor. The same as we done kind of here for when you are sitting there, you put your legs on there because that's too low. We've been out, we have tested them quite a few times before we finished the video off because we weren't unsure whether we'd like the seats and we knew we wanted them, but they're in now, they're done. And um, yeah, you're never gonna guess where we are, will they? I think they might guess. Do you think if you if you can guess in the comment section be below where we are right now, you get a point. Point. Have a guess. What part of the UK we're in? Do you think they'll guess? Nice part. What? It's a nice part. Well, I think they'll guess one or two places. One will be wrong and the other one will be right. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, I'll bet you. Whatever you're thinking, you're wrong. That's all I can say. Right, we're going to um, have food. Mm, I'm going on a little <laughs> bit of a trip. That'll be the next video. Yes. Right. Catch you later. Bye bye. She's going. I'm going. Food time. Cup of tea. Yeah. Thank you to the guys from Mule for arranging this and sorting this out for us because they are master craftsmen. And legends.